Hello students hope everyone is doing fine so today students let's begin with chapter 5 let's learn to live for others so what does it mean we should always be selfless and not selfish people remember the person who helped them in their dire need them means the person who are needy so here a story for you The story is about a boy named Naman who went for a picnic with his family which includes Teddy. Teddy now students you must be wondering who was Teddy so he was a dog who did his best to save Naman. Yes you ho- you all heard it right. Teddy was a very faithful dog when all of them went for a picnic Naman jumped into a canal to have a swim but he suffocated inside the water and died. Teddy tried his best to save Naman by pulling hair with his teeth to drag Naman to the bank of the river but after admitted to the hospital he expired and Teddy was suddenly uh, saddened by the incident and he made a few revisit in the hospital and the crematorium in a hope that he would be able to find Naman and without tolerating the pain right after a few days he also died So the whole family was deeply saddened by the incident. Here is another story students let's read. Kamudi and her brother Sharath were going towards the bus stop. He was it was a winter morning. Suddenly they saw that a car raced from behind and stopped near them. There were three men sitting in the car. One of them came out, dragged Kamudi gagged her mouth but put her in the car and sped away sharath felt helpless for the moment he raised an alarm which was lost in the noise of the traffic so he rushed to a house nearby and went straight to the room where the telephone lay on the table he dialed the number of the police station and said some miscreants traveling in a blue fiat car number PL473 have kidnapped my sister from the road the car has the eastern route on the delhi road please help me then he went home and told his parents who hurried to the police station sharath's father learned that after sharath's report on the phone the police flashed the information regarding the incident to all police stations through a wireless While Sharath's father was still sitting in the police station the telephone rang the police inspector listened to the message he smiled and told Sharath's father we have found your daughter please stay here she is being brought here by police after all about half an hour kamudi reached there in a police van the inspector recommended Sharath's name for an award What do we learn from these two stories? The dog tried to save Naman's life but was unable to do so. He gave his own life in grief for his friend and Sharath took quick action and informed the police about kidnapping on the telephone. Thus his sister was rescued from a dreadful situation. So both the stories tell of an in- identical situation, right? In both cases an effort was made to save someone from a difficult situation and the effort may succeed or fail but we should try our best and what is the moral students success rests in the hands of god thank you so much please read this two stories properly thank you and take care